Alright, error code. Let's see here. Oh boy. Error code OXC four E B eight two seven F. Let me write that down. I'll be back. Alright, YouTube, so this is bizarre. The printer started working again. Alright. After I was screwing around with it, you know, trying to get it to print holding the the button down here. Um I got this error code. It's the uh, OXC4EB827F. Um, <coughs> I looked it up online. <coughs> That's a, a printer head error. So um, I was, you know, reading the little bit of information that's available out there, and it it said to uh, open your cover. Remove the print cartridges, close it, then uh, power it off, you know, do a hard hard off, plug it back in. Anyways, the print cartridges wouldn't move. They were stuck over here. So what I did was I powered it back up and uh, I held the button down and then jiggled the print head and bam it's working now so as much as this uh, adapter is screaming it's got to be an issue with the print head but I'll show you here let me uh, plug it back in just jiggling that print head I don't know oh Turn around here. See, I was able to print that. Secret Service is going to come. I, I did the alignment page and the scan. I'll show you. We'll do it again. See, it's firing right up to the home screen. Um, we'll do the alignment first. I'm still going to order that power adapter because that noise is just going right through my freaking ears. Alright, so if we do a line printer. Alright, alignment sheet, I'll take it off, I'll take this other alignment sheet out, stick this one in, that's okay. The scanner is working. It's scanning. Alignment successful. Go 
click there. We'll do a home. We'll do a copy that it wasn't doing before. Just do a black copy. There you go. That's it, man. Like I said, I'm going to order that power adapter. I'll probably do a video replacing that when I get it. But uh, if you're having this problem, try what I just did. Um, it's a pretty simple solution. So, crappy product, though. Crap product. All right. See ya.